Hey guys, Nikki here, and this is a long awaited. <laughs> Don't y'all hate when people say that? Like, is it really long awaited? Not really. My beauty room tour, the purple room. What are we calling this? The prince room, purple rain room, whatever you want to call it. I'm going to show you how I organize my purses, my glasses. And I bought a new jewelry organizer and you guys are gonna do that with me so if you're interested in this type of videos please continue to watch Alright guys, as you guys know, my garage, half of it was converted. So, let's just start with the shelves. They came from Walmart. They were roughly around 29 bucks each. Very inexpensive to build this makeshift closet look. I still have a lot of organizing to do because it's still a little too cluttered for me. But I am in the process right now of throwing and giving a lot of stuff away. So, we're going to make it happen. So, this is just the overall view of where I keep my jewelry, my makeup, my sunglasses my eyeglasses everything is stored in this room and all of this will change pretty soon but i wanted to show you guys this setup it's a little different it's me it makes me happy i love it um it's not most like most youtubers um it's just full of purple and girly things and that's the way i love it so we're going to start with this shelf right here it has my new kurt geiger i haven't even had that yet i don't think and some other purses there. This is my Louis Vuitton Speedy 30 WA Azure and Never Full MM. And I have Louis Vuitton bandos tied to them with some brushes right there. These are all black and gold purses ranging from Tory Burch, Chanel, different designers right here on this shelf. My intention was to make this whole bookshelf thing purple. But that was going to make me keep buying purple bags just to buy them. So, uh, yeah, we're going to move into new. We have Teflor, Rebecca Minkoff, Chanel, and Gucci, and more Rebecca Minkoff back there. So, yeah, that's that section right there. Maybe Aldo. I said Rebecca Minkoff twice. So, here's other purses. Um, all black or black and silver. I don't know how that YSL clutch got right there. I just got back from out of town, so maybe that's how. But that's that whole section right there. That's just purses. Um, I do have an entire different closet with colored purses and stuff, but we're going over the beauty room today. So this is another section. It's purses as well. And if you guys can see at the top, I had lights. I need to put new batteries in them because I left them on one night. But that light strip came from Amazon. So let's just go over this section real quick. There's more purple bags. That bag in the front actually came from Fashion Nova. The other two are fantasy bags that I got from my plug. Um, that Chanel tote, you can make that yourself. Get it in any color, get some flat back pearls, and go to work. I didn't make mine, but you can make yours. And that other bag came from Shein. The pearl handle came from Amazon. So this is Marc Jacobs. Kurt Geiger, you guys know I'm getting into Kurt Geiger a lot. I don't know, earlier did I call that sequin bag Kurt Geiger or Tory Burch? It's Kurt Geiger, guys. There's another Kurt Geiger, very inexpensive. Dillers, Macy, Nordstrom's. None of the bags are over 300 or Rebecca Minkoff and my Alma that I painted purple. This purple is pulling blue on camera, of course. There's a bag from Aldo and like some dupe like Chanel bags. And back there's a Marc Jacobs bag. So let's just move into this little section. This is the section that's going to change. I'm going to take those clothes down and put the shelf there to store more stuff. That's my Apple watch band organizer. I got it from Amazon. And please know everything that I talk about as much as I can will be linked in the description box. Those black roses are from Rose Forever. I'm actually thinking about selling those. <laughs> this is a Juicy Couture vanity kit and I just have purple palettes in it. And those are my purple stretch braces that I get from Unraised Treasure and um, Rihanna's Closet, Reese's Closet. So yeah, here are my designer sunglasses right here. I keep them right there and down here is a bunch of purple bath and body work stuff. <laughs> Everything right here is purple. If it's not purple, it go in my bathroom or in my room. That cup is from Amazon and back there you will see a whole lot of Starbucks tumblers. Okay, don't judge me. If a Starbucks tumbler has any hit of purple in it, I want it. 
I wanted with some toppers, straw toppers. And that little bag right there came from Victoria's Secret. So right here we have some Tory Burch and Kate Spade bags, Juicy Couture bags. That silver bag is a spin a night bag. It actually say that on there. And this is just a bunch of random stuff. I still have to work on that part. This board is like pictures from Gym Beauty, Ipsy, all that kind of stuff. And let's remove these and I'm going to get into my eyeglasses. Now you saw where I store the designer sunglasses. Keep them in there real protected and when I travel I just put them in their case. And this is where I store my prescription. I just threw over 15 pair away because they were my old prescription. So let's move into some new glasses I got. I actually need another case like this because I have them stacked two and two because I have so many pair and I could just see myself scratching them like this. So this is what this look like. I get most of my glasses from Z Lul. Um, so yeah, I got six new pair and they will be sponsoring this part of the video. So let's get into it live. All right, guys, so this portion of the video will be sponsored by Zlul. They aren't a stranger to my channel. Obviously, I have on some Zlul glasses now. So let's just get into everything that they sent me. No, we're not going to get into everything that they sent me. I want to tell you guys that I absolutely love this company. I've worked with them numerous of times. They are very inexpensive. I have been getting my glasses from them for years because like literally almost out my whole house wear glasses so I could get everybody glasses. Sometimes they will have like $5 deals, everything. I love the fact that you can plug in a picture and try the frames on. I love the fact that all of their frames, mostly all of their frames come in multiple colors. Um, it's just a very good website. Um, please remember, I know that glare bothers y'all, but we talking about glasses and we need the light. <laughs> but please remember that if you don't wear prescription glasses, let's rewind. All of mine are prescribed. Negative 5.25 because I cannot see. But if you don't wear prescription glasses, you can still get glasses for Blu-ray. So when you're on your computer, when you're on your phone, when you're driving at night, all that extra glare is blocked out, okay? So let's just get into what I was saying. Exclaim, I don't know what it is. <laughs> so just like any eyeglass video I do, you guys pick your favorite in the comments. <laughs> Here's the box that you will receive your glasses in. Each pair of glasses will come in a pouch like this so you can protect them and keep them in. And each pair of glasses will come with a cleaning cloth. So if you wear eyeglasses, you know these cloths are very important, honey, because this is the only kind of cloth that really gets your glasses clean. So I do have six pair of glasses to show you all, so let's get into it. Before we get into it, just know each pair of glasses will come with protective plastic so you don't have to worry about them getting scratched or anything in shipment to you all. Just know that every single glass that I show you, the name will be at the bottom of the screen when I do the my shot, okay? So this is the first pair. So in this pair, I am seeing cranberry, black, brown, cream. This is a very pretty fall pair, all right? So let me give you a little close up of that right there. Love that, something very different. So this is a very simple pair, everyday pair. I love this pair. It is brown. It just blends right in with the melanin. Um, very, very cute. What do you guys think? Zoom in on y'all. <laughs> Almost tortoise a little bit, but not quite. Is this tortoise? Yeah, you can consider this tortoise. Very, very cute glasses. Let me just zoom on in, sit on in. Cause y'all need to see the heat. See the heat? This is like Christmas, honey, because I never know what I'm about to open up. I swear I don't. <laughs> oh, I see some green, blue or something though. <laughs> eye action going on right here different colors we got some turquoise um actually that's teal the front is black and it unbraced to like a pretty teal 
Would I typically pick these glasses? No, but they are still cute, right? You think they're cute? You think I'm rocking them? <laughs> Guys, these are too freaking cute. They are so cute. The only problem is, if you know me, y'all know I don't typically go for the wire because your girl be falling asleep in her glasses and breaking them. <laughs> so, yeah. But they are too cute. Like, I'm going to just have to risk it because they giving what needs to be gave today. Okay? What, what y'all think? Honestly, I wouldn't gravitate to these, but I put them on. <laughs> I put them on. Y'all see me? I put them on and they pop and they are like this pale pink. You guys see them? They are freaking bum. Sorry, I'm looking in the monitor instead of y'all, but I gotta see me to make sure I'm focused. They look good on me. Y'all know how it go. So yeah. I love these. I love these. But that's been my favorite so far. I'm going to wait to the end to tell y'all my favorite. But I love them being cute, right? Our last and final pair. I don't know why I want to say I got these glasses I already do. Y'all got so many pair of glasses. It's ridiculous. Probably 50 prescribed so I am not gonna ever have a mistake and I can't see y'all know I break my glasses every other week and just go get some more <laughs> so yeah this is a really cute pair basic clear go with everything this is a holy grail pair so I feel like if you go on a website and you see other glasses that you really really like get these too because they, they go with everything you get what I'm saying we're here right. so that's all of the glasses that I got from Zilu I love the company no joke. I will leave the link to Zillow below along with the direct link to every single glass pair of glasses that I showed you guys. All right. Check my fam out over there and let's move into the video. Now that you saw all of my awesome new glasses and how I store them, let's move into the rest. That couch is a couch my mom bought years ago. No matter where I move, I cover it and use it. I just can't throw it away. I'm going to end up doing it soon, but I haven't. This little section is just full of knickknacks. There's more robes for Everflowers, Teflar bag, my big purple one, my Versace robe that is too big and I refuse to sell it because it was limited edition so you cannot get purple anymore so why would I sell it? <laughs> my pictures came from Burlington and all of this stuff you guys have seen over and over. Those cabinets came from Michaels. I actually stacked them on top of each other. That's four of them. That one in the middle, I got it off of like offer up or something and that's just a lot of acrylic organizers so i will be going through this makeup really soon because a lot of it has to go guys we just we're not really into makeup like that anymore it's crazy what are we into now perfumes and luxury living and traveling and stuff and so i'm gonna do a sale on my website to get rid of a lot of this makeup that i'm not using so this was gifted to me for Christmas. It has bracelets in it, but we're going to get more into this a little bit further into the video when I organize my jewelry. I just have random Chanel bags and stuff people have gifted me. There's purple candles everywhere. There's like four back there. And this little thing came from Burlington. I get a lot of my stuff from Burlington. Y'all know that. Y'all know that. Don't play me. Don't play me. And those um, bling brushes a set I got from Amazon and a set my friend made so I just got a couple of purple palettes right here and another candle is probably more than that back there <laughs> so those racks are super old thumbs up if you remember the glam I can't even remember but she made those and I painted them <laughs> so here's like a little tray that has like perfume bottles that I got gifted for Christmas and from some of you guys some amethyst stones are in there um, and yeah, right behind there, there's more bracelets. I have those bracelets everywhere in my bling headbands. And yeah, y'all remember the Millennium eyeshadows? See, it's time to get rid of some of this stuff. <laughs> so yeah, that's the whole entire beauty room. Like I said, anything that I can link, I will. 
and over here is rocking my hats and here's a whole nother rack from michael's full of makeup too mostly like my lashes and single eyeshadows and etc like that and then i got a little section over here i usually wouldn't show y'all this but it's just over here an overflow here are my sunglasses i will link the sunglass racks girl i should have straightened them up those are the ones that aren't designer or are designer dupes and then this is a whole bunch of stuff i use for giveaways or stuff i need to show you guys or stuff I need to put up, more candles. It just look a mess, right? It looks a mess, because it is. It is. It is, girl, it is. But we're going to work through that when I start doing my makeup sale and etc. So now let's move into organizing my jewelry. Now, all of my jewelry tangled. So I got this from Amazon. And guys, it's originally like $120, but I got mine for $90 because I got like a return or something like that. You know how you have the option to click a used one or... A return I don't know because it wasn't used at all so I saved like 30 40 bucks clicking that option and it was brand new so right here I'm just taking it out the box there's a protective sleeve do not take that off until you are done okay done with everything I absolutely love this in the inside is a light and everything it slots for your rings your necklaces your everything and it's made by nice tree I wanted the one that like you sit on a stand because I thought that would be easier but this one was cheaper, honey, so I went this route. So now you can see all the different slots in here. Love, love, love this. It's even a spot for your earrings. And it do come with two keys so that you can lock it. Now, if you have to lock some in your house, honey, you might need to control who in your house. But anyway, it's battery operated because there is a light at the top. So if it's dark, you can open it up, turn the light on, and see the jewelry that you are picking out. And I'm going to show you guys how that work in just a second. So it do take three AAA batteries. So when you check it out on Amazon, make sure you add those batteries in your cart. So right here, you stick the double-sided tape to the bottom of each side because at the top is going to go in the wall. And shout out to my favorite dress. Y'all know I love these dresses. So let's get to putting this on the wall. I was hell-bent on doing this without Nicole help, and I did. So I already put the two screws in the wall, and yeah, I was struggling. You're a woman, I always use a bench, some pillows or something to level this out. So if you have to drop it or something, you don't break it. You have something to sit it on. I end up, end up having to get pillows to put it on here, but I don't think I recorded that part. So your girl was struggling, y'all. Oh, because who thought my measurements was off? <laughs> had to pop some pillows up and come back. <laughs> All right, 10 minutes later, there's your light right there. You see how they work? Very, very cute. And you can also get these that has the LED light on the outside. But, child, I didn't eat all it. All right, so I just got back from Miami. I didn't even unpack this because I knew I was going to put this up today. So let me show you what all I will be moving. I'm not going to mess with, like, any of these type of bracelets. But in here, as you guys can see, all of my necklaces and stuff are starting to tangle. And then I have tons of jewelry just like over here in the boxes still that I don't wear because out of sight, out of mind. And tons of glasses, guys. So let's reorganize. Right, so this is everything that was in that travel thing. Just put two pair of earrings right there. Just put two pair of earrings right there. Here are my coach bracelets, the silver gold. I'm going to put the rose golds right here, some of my earrings, Tiffany bracelet, and I am going to move my gold and silver um, bracelets here, so let's do that. So I am going to just take both of these drawers. This is just not functional for this because my necklaces are getting tangled, so let's go. definitely some progress here definitely still struggling so i'm gonna take a break from these necklaces and start on something else while i break let's work on this dresser because that's about to send me the glory you hear me these are all apple watch bands right here so here's the actual watch let's just get this stuff put up i've decided to keep the apple watch bands in here all right so we got all well i'll accept the tangle necklaces set up Here's a couple of pair of earrings, tennis bracelets right here and here. Here's my emblems. I don't have them on the necklaces. They go on and Apple Watch bands. So now we are going to put up the last four slots. 
I mean drawers. All right, guys. So I decided to keep this style bracelet in here. So this is gold, rose gold, and um silver. And then these are all like charms that I fell off my bracelets. I keep them because I'm supposed to put them back on. But the little tool you use is at the warehouse, so I always forget to bring it home. Still gotta untangle these. But this is what we have so far. This lets out, of course, so that you can put your earrings on there. Um. Here's another slot for earrings and stuff. I have the teardrop earrings right here. And here's a spot for rings. Here's my rose gold plaque braces, which I got a love-hate relationship with these. I love these, but baby, trying to take them off sometime by yourself. Here's some more different style bracelets and my coaching LV earrings. Here's some charms. I mean, have I went over this? yeah let's just keep going <laughs> all right so this is all the jewelry i really need hung up because i really need to start wearing it and seeing what is in it honey so much tiffany stuff i forgot i even had i got last christmas honey it's about to be christmas again just let's get this stuff put up honestly i'm gonna leave the tiffany jewelry in the boxes though because it tarnishes and you can get well i have silver stuff to um you know remove the tarnish but if i'm not wearing it right now i might as well leave it in the box this is the box of the earrings i already have up and this is a brand new bracelet i just got i'll leave it in the box too this bracelet right here from louis vuitton i must look like my apple watch band all right guys so this is everything i have left doing a pretty 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 good job <laughs> I just had to save my stuff ace because it was all looking like this. But Nicole is great at detangling, so I'm gonna just save this for her because it's about to flare my anxiety. Babe just came home and detangled all the rest. Twelve hours later. All right, guys, we got earrings, necklaces. This opens. I just showed you guys this. I think I'm not sure. I'm texting my cousin as I do this. <laughs> um, more earrings in this open. Behind here is rings. Of course, here's the bracelets I put up. Look at this beautiful bracelet. J. Marie Beauty scent. I haven't worn it. See stuff like that. Um, yeah. So, bracelets and a couple earrings. Boxes. Here's emblems emblems more earrings apple watch bands and tiffany jewelry and kendra scott earrings and tiffany jewelry and kendra scott earrings and these are some um diamonds so stuff. the last and final step would be to take uh oh i can't close it we'll see why in a minute take this off Ooh, ooh! look at your girl <laughs> false alarm it closed <laughs> Yeah, and so I got my mirror now too.